All right, hello. We're back. Hi. Hi, hi. We're back with more Metal Gear Solid with the Bun Bun. Very good uh -uh. fun times. Uh uh. Uh uh. What do you mean? Uh uh. No. Uh -uh. You missed. You missed something. What? I missed something. Yes. Um, Someone else is hard to find now. Oh, and big. Yay! Best baby in the world. Yeah. Hooray! Why? Why aren't you celebrating? Yay! Exactly. And oh my Not god! I'm... Please, please subscribe to the Santa Bun, please. <laughs> <laughs> we know. We know. Yep. Oh my goodness, Veggie, come on, what is this? Well, Why did you leave on on that? I got jump scared, I'm scared oh, now. Peekaboo. I'm scared. I don't like that. Yeah, we have everybody's Kodak numbers. Dum Dum, what is that camera angle? <laughs> what was that? It's a pretty great camera angle. You no, it's a not. bit. <laughs> no. <laughs> No. Oh uh, no. No. So, out. There should be a few new things we can get now that we have um, E card number four. Get some stun grenades. And I think these are still gone because I already collected them. Yes, you did. Yep. Uh, we will have to come back here later once we get another key card because there's another item here. But for now, we're we're good. Ding ding. So we'll have to go up to floor one for a while, at least for a little bit. Wait, what more did you go? Where did you go? Hmm, Don't move. That's the second time I've been able to sneak up on the legendary solid snake. Your Meryl? There's no way you could pass for a man for long. What do you mean? Hey, men aren't allowed in here. I had no idea you were so feminine. This is no time to try and hit <laughs> on me, Snake. Great way to start. Uh, is it... Is that sure? Besides, How is that being feminine? Time. When I joined up, they gave me psychotherapy to destroy my interest in men. Same smart mouth. You're Meryl, all right. Are you hurt? Not yet. After all, I was disguised as a genome soldier. So why'd you change? You'd be a lot better off dressed like one of them. I got tired of disguising myself. The truth is, the uniform smelled like blood. What's that mark? Huh? Oh, this? It's a paint tattoo. It's not real. I was a fan of Foxhound way back, when guys like you and my uncle were in it. None of that gene therapy like there is today. You guys were real heroes. There are no heroes in war. All the heroes I know are either dead or in prison. One or the other. But Snake, you're a hero, aren't you? I'm just a man who's good at what he does. Killing. There's no winning or losing for a mercenary. The only winners in war are the people. That's right, and you fight for the people. I've never fought for anyone but myself. I've got no purpose in life, no ultimate goal. Come on. It's only when I'm cheating death on the battlefield. The only time I feel truly alive. Seeing other people die makes you feel alive, huh? You love war and don't want it to stop? Is it the same with all great soldiers throughout history? Why didn't you contact me? My codec was broken. Is that all? Shouldn't you just be happy we met up like this? How did you recognize me in disguise? I never forget a lady. So, that's <laughs> something you like about me, huh? What do you mean? Yeah, you've got a great butt. Oh, I see. First it's my eyes, now it's my butt. And what's next? On the battlefield, you never think about what's next. So, Snake, how are the negotiations going? No progress. So it's all up to you, huh? Somebody's got to stop them from launching a nuclear missile. There are two ways. Either we destroy Metal Gear or... 
We override the detonation code. You got the card keys from Baker? Card keys? You mean this? Where are the others? There should be three keys. This is all I've got. Where could the other two be? I have no idea, but they must be somewhere. If we can't find them, we'll have no choice but to destroy Metal Gear. Metal Gear is in an underground maintenance base to the north. Take me too. I know this place better than you do. You'll just slow me down. You don't have enough battle experience. Ooh, I won't slow so you down. Mean. I promise. Aww, what if you so do? Mean. Then you can shoot me. I don't like to waste bullets. Got it. I'll be careful. You know, I don't use makeup the way other women do. I hardly ever look at myself in the mirror. I've always despised that kind of woman. I always dreamed of becoming a soldier. That ain't was feminine. <laughs> it wasn't really my dream. No my offense, father, but he was killed in action Snake, when I was you younger. You need to learn. You wanted to follow him. <laughs> you gotta learn. Steps. Not really. I thought that if I became a soldier, I could understand him better. Under the definition of feminine, so I wear nails, I, I do makeup, I like dress and nicely. I ask Katie, sweetie. The truth is, I was just afraid of looking at myself, afraid of having to make my own decisions in life. But I'm not gonna lie to myself anymore. It's time I took a long, hard look at myself. I wanna know who I am, what I'm capable of. I wanna know why I've lived the way I've lived until now. I want to know. Take a good look. You won't get another chance for a while. You should wash your face, too, while you're at it. Yeah. This isn't a training exercise. Our lives are riding on this. There are no heroes or heroines. If you lose, you're worm food. Yeah. Is that FAMAS functional? Unfortunately, it's out of ammo. Where did you get that Desert Eagle? I found it in the armory. It's a 50 caliber Action Express. There was a SOCOM pistol, too, but I chose this. Huh. So I got a leftover, huh? Isn't that gun a little big for a girl? Don't worry, I can handle it. Come on, use my 45. Listen, I've used a gun like this since I was eight years old. I'm more comfortable with it than I am with a bra. If we're gonna go to the north, we'll have to go through the commander's room on this floor. The overland route is blocked by glaciers. The door to the commander's room is security level five. This card will open it. It was inside the pocket of the uniform I was wearing. Looks like he must have been guarding someplace important. Okay, let's go. I know this place better than you. I'll be point man. Follow me. Yeah, now we got Meryl on our team. <laughs> why was she why was she looking down in that scene? And then she's shorter than. Mm, I'm not sure, cutie. Probably just for like, uh, what do you call it? Like, a modic like, effect. Yeah, pretty much it. Not, no, not much better reason than that. That's strange. There's no guard. What happened to the music? I'll keep a lookout. Make sure you're ready, okay? <laughs> just casual breaking the fourth wall. Where's the music? <laughs> Oh yeah, another thing, cutie, is since there are no guards, you can actually uh, go back and pick up all the stuff you missed without having to worry about getting spotted. That's very nice. Right, BB? Yeah, sure. Yeah, pat pat. What? Hmm, <laughs> you comfy? Huh? You comfy, BB? Yeah, sure. Oh, good. Wrap these. Uh, snuggle. Oh, snuggly. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. What? I'm just making sure you're comfy. Snake, what are you doing? Let's go to the commander's room. Why can't you go to the restroom? I, I, don't know. I need. I always go to the restroom like every hour. I'm sorry. Aww. See, poor BB would suffer because of that. I'm just. The girl. Oh, I'm the girl in the world. Oh, it hurts. What's wrong? Don't come here, drink. snake. 
Are you okay? Uh, uh, what happened? I'm fine. That does uh, okay. sound like he's fine. Let's go. Yeah, that's he sounded like a... <laughs> it doesn't sound very he sound... fine. He sounded like a robot. <laughs> Oh, boy. Yeah, robot filter. <laughs> uh, should I be worried? Probably. Hello? What? what are you unsure yourself? Um, okay, it's, uh, okay, you should definitely be worried then, BB. Oh, I'm scared. Snake, Meryl's not herself. Don't use your weapon. It's Psycho Mantis. He's controlling Meryl. That tune is his mind control music. Don't use your weapon. Try to knock her out. Oh, so you just... Okay. <laughs> you gotta calm her down somehow. <laughs> you always beat me up like that? No, I wouldn't okay. beat you. Yes, you would. Optic no, not more. I hope that's not your. I would hug okay, you well, instead. No, gross. What? What's wrong with hugging? I might beat you up and stuff. So. Oh. I want to finish you off. Please don't. I'm clingy. I know. I know. Okay, then it's done. Yay, one more. One more. Is that supposed to <laughs> You are somewhat reckless. I can read you like an open book. What is that completely clean memory? It means I don't have any saved data. <laughs> Something going on? Um, it's supposed to be rumbling. <laughs> the it's over. I have the rumble off though. <laughs> you suck. Uh, oh. Huh? Ow. <laughs> what was that? Uh, looks like my TV turned off. 
You suck. You suck. Oh, how do I suck, yeah, so dude? Much, you had so much time preparing. And your TV turns on. Yeah, why my TV turned off? Because your TV is sucks. Mine is better. Aw, oh, you have the best TV. I do. That's yeah. Psycho Mantis, former KGB psychic. He has powerful telepathic abilities. After the collapse of the Soviet Union, he came to America looking for a job. He worked with the FBI on several cases as a psychic profiler. Five years ago, he was working on the case of a multiple serial murderer. They got too far into the killer's mind. As a result, he became just like the killer. So he was sort of infected by this serial murderer's thoughts? In any case, after that, he became a sort of psychic spy working for the highest bidder. He traveled all around the world. That's when he was recruited by Foxhound. He can read people's minds. He knows every move that you're going to make. What should I do? I've got no chance of beating him. There must be some way. He's a master at controlling people, Snake. Don't let him manipulate you. Well, that's all we have. Ow. Now watch out for the furniture. <laughs> Eyes is real. Destroying his spirit is more important than destroying his body. Don't let him read you. Be a blank slate, okay? Clear your mind. Wait, what? Where is his soul? He read your mind with his psychic abilities. Somehow you've got to get around him. <laughs> you want to take a wild guess on what you're supposed to do to uh, hit him, hun? <laughs> what? They destroy the church? Nope. <laughs> what? You might not be able to guess it at first, DB. <laughs> Why? <laughs> one more, one more try, DB. <laughs> you meant two more. Dum dum. Oh no, my TV turned off again. Stop! <laughs> <laughs> Oops. What's wrong with your TV? I don't know. Please, it keeps, it keeps stop, turning stop, off. Stop sneezing. Bless you, Beast. I'm just scared. He's using his psychic ability to read your controller's moves. That's how he's evading your attack. You've got to you do drop something, something so he can read your controller's moves. Think. There must be some way. Uh, destroy some posters or destroy his, uh, his like. Transparent shield, I don't know. Oh, that's not it, behind you. You suck. Works by no, no. The light the you suck. Why? Why do I suck? What'd I do? Because your TV be keeps on turning up. I hate it. Oh, I'm sorry about my TV. I hate it. My TV is better, I told you. <laughs> it's it best. doesn't turn up. It is, because it doesn't turn Psychics know. range in power from those who can bend spoons to those who can cause natural disasters. But Psycho Mantis is one of the most powerful... What is she creatures. holding in her mouth? A cigarette. A Master, cigarette help me. Like that. It's true. Your enemy is a powerful telepath. But you've got more battle experience. You can do it, Snake. What Thanks. is she doing? Thanks, Master. What did she do? Yeah, she pushed something else off. Big, what are you doing? Or maybe you have to die? Mm, not quite, Klein, yet. I've got it. Use the controller port. Plug your controller into controller port 2. If you do that, he won't be able to read your mind. Yep. What's controller port 2? <laughs> That's the solution. <laughs> What's controller port 2? Uh, controller port 2. <laughs> What's that? Well, honey, <laughs> on the PlayStation, there are two different pl plugs you can put your controller into. 
And if you put it into the second port, you'll be player two. <laughs> what if I plugged in in port two already? Um, then you can basically skip that. I just wanted to show that you can do that. I, uh, knowing me, I would probably put it on port two because I prefer the number two over one. Mm -hmm. Alright, we're going to turn off controller number one. Well, I need to not get hit first. You suck. Ow. You suck. Ow. You suck. Why do I suck? Because you keep getting hit. Why are you dodging me again? I, I thought I turned off the first controller. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, what's up, Phoebe, hon? I hate this episode. Why? Because Baby Beak is sick, so very terrible. Number two, your TV is screwed over and you can't even play today. And you screwed up the controller. Yeah, I did. And you, yeah. So? Uh, Edgy messed up. Yes, you did. Yeah, Edgy messed up big time. You suck at this. Hmm. I wonder why, uh, my controller's not getting registered Snake, properly. What are you doing? Let's go to the commander's room. Because. You're not playing on PlayStation. Intro. Exactly. That's why. Right. Yeah, Muffin. Come on, Mr. Foxhound. The commander is waiting. I'll try this again, I guess. This rash is a little clear. Come on. <laughs> there we go. Now let me read you. Nope, don't care. Oh, my TV. Thomas. <laughs> Thomas. What are you doing? I was able to hit him one time. Where are you at? That's gonna take forever. Yeah, he keeps he keeps thinking uh I have controller one plugged in. Alright, let's try that again. Uh, yeah, so for the trying, why are you? Why, is this? why is it not working? There we go. It's not the controller problem, it's the freaking you play problem because the rage sucks. Hmm. Maybe. We saw how he, he only got uh, attacked from up close. Uh, maybe. But you, why is your TV breaking so often? I don't know, baby. It's annoying. Oh, sorry, Muffin. Can't you fix it? I'll try. Why are you tr gonna try? There we go. 
Oh my goodness, I'm asleep now. Good night. Oh, sweetie, how are you? No, I'm not talking to you. Good night. No, why don't you want to talk to me? I'm, I'm really a sad. sleepy baby. I'm a sleepy baby. She's better. I'm a sleepy baby. Yeah, she's better than me. Why? What's wrong with me? Because you suck. But I wish you luck. Thank you, Pioneer. Thank you. Well, there's a backup plan. If um, Whoa. if you're if you're not Whoa. able to use the second controller port behind you, you can destroy the statues oh in this goodness. room. Oh my goodness! Aw, why are you complaining yeah, so yeah, much, Bun yeah. Bun? Yeah, yeah, I already guessed that. Genius. Oh, honey is a genius. Didn't didn't the first thing I say was destroy some like the prop, something like the chairs. Well, okay, it's, not, it's, not, it's, not, it's, it's not the chairs, it's the statue. I said, shut the fuck up, it's the same thing. Fucking fine, you're half at, no I, angry. I said, I said destroy something like the chairs, so it, the statues uh, are... No, I, 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 my, my bad, love, I thought you said destroy the chairs. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna destroy you next. Oh, okay, you can. No more. Okay, you're dead now. You. Yay, I'm dead. Why yay? Because <laughs> you're very cute. You're dead. I bet he's dead. So you can't touch me or me. Why not? Because you're dead. Girls, girls can't touch me. Ow. Ha <laughs> ha. <laughs> <laughs> Uh -huh. Good job, ghost. <laughs> good job, ghost. Yeah, good job, ghost. Get back here. No, I don't want to. Why are you beating me up again? Uh, you getting mind controlled again, honey? <laughs> huh? You being mind controlled, honey? <laughs> I'm gonna I'm shoot myself. No, please don't, love. Uh, okay, pew pew, sh I shot myself. Dead. Nice saving, you got the dumbass. Hello? Oh, hello. I shot myself. Please don't, beauty. I did. Pew pew gone. Oh, pew pew. Why are you happy that I shot myself? No, so no, mean. no, 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 don't go away, Kitty. I love you. I did. I did. I went away. Ow. You suck. <laughs> he fell over the table. You should have done that. No! You should have done that. Your niece is going to be okay. Thanks. Thank no, go away. I no, I don't want to go away. Is beaten. Yes, Meryl's go brainwashing away, should wear off, right, Naomi? Yes. But why did you go so far out of your way to save her? For Campbell's sake, or maybe it's because you like her? I don't want to see any woman die right in front of me. Oh, really? Since when did anybody's death bother you so much? Naomi, it's true that Snake has killed a lot of people, but that doesn't mean he doesn't have a heart. It's okay, Colonel. She's right. 
That's sad. Poor Honey's eyes, no more. To get to Metal Gear's underground maintenance base, you have to go through. No, I'm not joking. My ass generally hurts now. Oh, I'm sorry. Necessary. I'm, I'm being Why are you serious. Me this? I can read Dramatic effect, I guess. Lines. Yeah, more like I have damage effect. I strain or bun bun. You suck. You turn the rumble off. You turn the rumble off, but oh, it Ross. flashing lights. No. And each mind that I peered into was stuck with the same single object of obsession. That selfish and atavistic desire to pass on one seed. It was enough. What's to make with me his sick. face? Because I don't know. He has exists. scars on his face. Pass on that DNA. So what? Designed that way. That's why he wears them. That's why there is war. So what? But you. You are different. You're the same as us. We have no past. No future. We live in the moment. That's our only purpose. Humans weren't designed to bring each other happiness. From the moment we're thrown into this world, we're fated you to sound bring like each other that. but pain and misery. Oh, poor Bunny's eyes. The first person whose mind he I looks like a skeleton. Was my father's. Yeah, he kind of does. How is that, I saw nothing How is that but scary? disgust and hatred for me in his heart. My mother died in childbirth. And he despised me for it. I thought my father was going to kill me. Full emoji reaction. That's when my future yes, full emoji. disappeared. Also, where are his ears? He well. has no ears. When I came no, he yeah, has like very small the ears. Was engulfed <laughs> in flames. Are you saying that you burned your village down to bury your past? I see that you have suffered the same trauma. <laughs> okay, I like that guy. He's freaky. I don't like it. You and I. He is freaky. Though. Oh, More like creepy. That's creepy. Creepy. Place. Yeah. Creepy. People like you in it. Freaky means desperate nowadays, so I, I need to be careful. You're right. Revolution. Seiji, are you freaky for me? No. Me. Why not? Now is not the time. An excuse Why not? Because <laughs> we're supposed to have a fun, <laughs> cute time. Talk. He doesn't have much time left. What? What do you mean? I've seen At least. people. How do you What do you mean? You're just like You're precious. Boss. Yeah, yeah, whatever. I'm not listening to you. No, you're worse. I asked you Compared one question. You, I'm not so bad. So mean. Oh, mama. Yeah, I asked you one question. I you're so mean. Her mind as well. Meryl's? I saw you there. You have a large place in your heart. A large place? Yes, a large place. But I do not know if your futures lie together. I have a last request. What is it? That's I relatable. Put it back on. Okay. Like this, other people's thoughts force their way into my mind. Before I die, I want to be by myself. I want to be left alone in my own world. <laughs> I'll open the door for you. If you want to find your future, go through that door. Please. 
is the freaking. So many flashes flashing. for Bun Bun. Yes, very much for me. Is it necessary? No. Is it there? Yes. Oh, well, at least he died nicely. Yeah, he had a he had a happy death. I hope you have an whole unhappy one. Why? So mean. I'm sorry. Be because you did. <laughs> be because you didn't answer my question. How can I let Mantis <laughs> control oh, my mind like that? And I'm not gonna repeat. Because you, yourself, you said you no. Thank you. You're right. I'm gonna cry now. Never doubt Finally. yourself. Just let it make no, you stronger. No, go away. Learn something from it. I want to cuddle me. You're right. Because you said no. I'm sorry. Okay, how about yes? I won't do it again. <laughs> Snake, can I ask you something? What? Do you even remember Mantis what said? I asked? Yeah. I was just wondering. What? Oh. What's the problem now? Ooh. Oh, no, nothing. So, tell me, Snake. What's your name? Your real name? A name means nothing on the battlefield. How old are you? Old enough to know what death looks like. Any family? Blah, blah, blah. But I was raised by many people. So emo. The emo so answer. <laughs> anyone you like? I knew you were going to say that. I in anyone else's life. So you well, are alone. Well, how else? Just like How Mantis else said. do I define this? <laughs> well, I know you well enough. Just complicate my life. What's your name? I don't like to get involved. Doesn't matter. <laughs> it doesn't matter <laughs> on the battlefield. <laughs> What's your this age? Cold War. Old enough to old enough to die or something. <laughs> to know the age of death. <laughs> yeah. What's your name? Veggie, veggie. No, that's not your name. Uh, onion? Yeah. Hey. It looks like Meryl's okay. Thanks, Snake. Snake, there's no time left. You've got to hurry up and get to the underground base. You should be able to go north from the commander's room. I don't know where the commander room is. Oh, we're in the commander room right now. What a waste. I guess fighting was all he ever knew. Are you feeling sorry for him? Mantis had incredible power. What? Fantastic power. I am so I am so smart. I know. Hey. No, I'm not. Oh, I'm smart. I'm just for war. I'm not smart. There you are. Come The G. I literally love how I'm stupid. The tongues of dying men enforce attention. Like deep harmony. Snake, people don't normally lie with their dying breath. I think he was telling the truth. Maybe you should believe him. Please, Snake, don't give up. Alright, let's go. Let's continue. See, I'm such a genius. Number one, I wouldn't even change the port. Because I was already ch chosen two. And um, um, second thing, I do not even know where the commander room is. Yes, genius. <laughs> Number three, I was half an ice train dogs, during this half scene. Wolf, half husky. And I already How did. Do you know so much? I ride dog sleds. I'm a musher. What? I'll take point. Snake, you follow me. How is she not cold? <laughs> Good question, honey. Honey asks the best kinds of questions. The ones that Veggie doesn't think of. Yeah, Veggie's stupid though, but we don't talk about Veggie. Wow. What? You're, you're sad? I mean, I don't want to be stupid. Mm, I mean, I'll watch over the dogs. You're not, though. Oh, I'm smart. Maybe. Just hey. so. Hey. This place creeps me out. Why? Because it's underground cave? 
Oh my goodness, why is he so Wait, big? What's wrong? I big doggy. Good with dogs. Got, a little, got a little dog friend. Scary. Why are they scary? I hate big dogs. I hate them. Well, what are little dogs? Okay, he's cute. Yay. I mean, the big one is also cute. I, I don't <laughs> mind. Oh, he went to sleep. Okay, sure. Uh, I prefer my baby Beak over anything now. Oh, Beak is the best. True. But she's my baby. Oh, mine too. Yeah, ours. Yeah. This place is mine. I'll take point again. Stay back, okay? But the radar isn't working. And since we can't use the mind detector either... Leave it to me! Stop it! No, I'm about to sneeze all the time. Thanks, baby. Oh, bless you. This is her fault. No, I didn't sneeze yet, but I'm about... My... I can't feel it. <clears throat> what is she doing? Um... <laughs> there's, um... There's an invisible mind maze here. And how does she know? Um, pretty sure she explains why. So, what do you think? Pretty good, huh? How did you know where the mines were? It sounds weird, but when Mantis dove into my mind, I was able to see where the mines were placed. Are you impressed? Well, a little bit. Only a little? <laughs> There's a lot of ways you could do this room. I'm pretty sure you can just do this. I would. No, I know what to do. I would just go around, like, the grates. You can. You can also do that, but you can also just crawl through the middle. Yeah, I would do the grate mm. part. Yeah, you're very smart. How am I smart? I need to know what's up. Meryl, get down! Meryl! Is she going to die? No. Snake, leave me and run. Meryl. I guess I am a rookie after all. Don't blah, worry, blah, Meryl. Blah, 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 blah. Even I know that. It's the oldest trick in the book. The sniper's using me for bait to lure you out. Damn. Shoot me, Snake. No. My gun. I can't reach it by myself. Don't move. I promised. I wouldn't slow you down. I... I... I, I can still help. I want to help you. Quiet down. Save your strength. I was a fool. I wanted to be a soldier. But war is ugly. There's nothing glamorous about it. Snake, please save yourself. Go on living and don't give up on people. Don't forget me. Now get out of here. Got a phone call. Meryl. Damn. Snake, it's a trap. The sniper's trick to lure you out. The sniper's waiting for you to go and help Meryl so he can pick you off. Don't do it. Must be Sniper Wolf, Foxhound's best shooter. Snipers usually work in pairs, but this one's alone, huh? I know her. She can wait for hours, days, or weeks. It doesn't matter to her. She's just watching and waiting for you to expose yourself. Maybe so, but Meryl can't hold out that long. Snake, can you see Wolf from where you are? There's nowhere to hide between here and the tower. She must be on the second floor of the tower. If Wolf is in the communications tower, she can see you perfectly. It's the classic sniper's position. 
At that distance, you won't be able to hit her with a standard weapon either. You'll need a sniper rifle. Colonel, take it easy. I'm gonna save Merrill, no matter what it takes. Okay. Thanks. What's wrong, Naomi? Nothing. I'm just surprised you're willing to sacrifice yourself. You got the genes of a soldier, not a savior. You trying to say that I'm only interested in saving my own skin? I wouldn't go that far, but... I don't know what the hell my genes look like, and I don't care. I operate on instinct. Like an animal? I'm going to save Meryl. I don't need an excuse. Okay. And I'm not doing it for someone else, either. I'm gonna save Meryl for myself. Colonel, don't worry. Snake, thanks. I understand. I'm sorry. I mean, I wish he had a rope beside him, rope? because he, yeah, if he somehow ties her up like a leg or hand and just, you know. Oh, you mean heal her up? Yeah. Yeah, that would be nice. So oh. she would just grab by the rope and just, she would just hold on to it and just, you know. And then drag her back to safety. Yeah. Hmm. Pretty smart thinking, then. Pretty, pretty smart thinking. That's logical. <laughs> Why you haven't thought of that? Mm, I haven't. Hon. Why not? I never thought about dragging with a rope. Well, what else then? Huh? Um, what would you do? Hmm. I'm not sure what I'd do. But I guess that is the mo the smartest option. Um, I can finally use the bathroom now. What's the point of this? Uh, there's no point. <laughs> I thought stupid. I thought there was a um, I thought there was a um, ration here. Oh fuck. You suck at this. Nope, you guys didn't see anything. You suck at this. Why is there a fucking box in the bathroom? <laughs> Why is there? And it's clipping and this clipping through the toilet seat. You know how is that smart? Um <laughs> It's not smart, don't <laughs> don't You should be ashamed of yourself. Don't worry about it, like me. Yes, I will. Worry because you can't even say uh, wifey because it says swifey. What's swifey? <laughs> swifey. <laughs> you suck. You know that. You're not even romantic. You can't play this game. Your TV sucks ass as well. <laughs> Your TV sucks. Oh what? Yeah. Oh what? Kitty needs some comfort. More comfort. Oh, more. More comfort. Snuggle. Sounds like you're More upset. Comfort. Are you upset with me, hon? Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. Is there anything I can do for you? Yeah. I'll cuddle you. Cuddle. Oh no, I'm not that upset. Well, Veggie's still sorry for being a dumb dog. What? Yeah, like that. I am worried about baby P. And she keeps on sneezing. I mean, she sneezes, huh? Poor baby P. Yeah, I am worried about her. Yeah, let's get the mind attack there. Where is it? Hmm? Where is it? Where's what, DB? Mines. Mines? Um. Mm -hmm. They'll have they'll have um these little these tiny little yellow cones on the map. That's that's where the mines are. Those aren't those aren't cones. Well, what would you call them, love? Flashlight. <laughs> flashlight. Okay, Kitty. What is a flashlight? I'm confused how it works, but okay. 
Why are you going through the yellow flashlight? If you're crawling, you can um you can pick up the you can pick up the mines. What is that claymore? Uh, it's a little explosive you plant on the ground, and when someone gets in range of it, it explodes. Alright, we're back here. I told you we'd back, be back here, sweetie. I, I forgot where we are. We're back in the tank hangar. We gotta go to the basement, love. No, I already forgot. Oh, bun bun for gore. I do. Hmm. I don't think anything good in here. Just some Nikita missiles. Goofy yeah, veggie angle again. I'm confused. Oh, why is Bun Bun confused? How is crawling make things easier? Um. So there's trip wires, and you have to crawl to sneak under them. No, I meant logically. Um, how, do, how does crawling help? Isn't it making things worse? Because uh, you're heavier when you're laying entirely on the ground? Hmm. Is that actually true? I mean, gravity. Hmm, if you, gravity? Uh, at least everything. If you're standing, then you could be careful because you can't just be on your tiptoes or you can't just walk around. But when you're crawling, how does it work? Like how does it how is it more effective than actually walking through? Uh oh. Uh, that's why. <laughs> Wolf. Hurry up and save uh, I didn't. I didn't realize there were vertical trip wires. <laughs> right, um, I got three rations. I'll be fine. If I'm not mistaken. There's also something here. You did not answer. Oh, what do you want me to answer, Cutie? The, uh, the laying down thing? Yeah. Um... Is it true that laying down makes you heavier? I mean, think logically. If I stand on you, would that be worse for you than me literally lying on you? Mm, I guess you're right. So, why is it better? Um... Well, if you're standing up and you go and you walk through a tripwire, if the tripwire is high up enough, you can get through it just by crawling over it. What's that tripwire? Um, oh. Shit. <laughs> oh, uh, oopsie, hun. Mm, you suck at this. <laughs> Thank you? No, thank you. You suck at this. <laughs> oh, honey said no thank you. Mm. Well, Kitty, um, a trip wire is a little sensor where if you walk, if you walk inside of it, it'll activate. Like it'll... Like, if it senses human contact, it goes off and it activates whatever it's linked to. So, basically, if a tripwire is like... Let's say a tripwire is about, you know, up to where your knees are. 
you know, if you ta basically you tap it, you tap it with your knee, and then the trap wire would go off, and then you get hurt by whatever the trap is. But if you're crawling, you crawl under the trip wire so that you're, you know, you're not knee height anymore. So you basically sneak under it. What? What? No. Knee height isn't a, lo a lot. And another thing, if you kneel down, then you need you obviously will be a bit taller than knee height because you have a mass. You're not really flat like paper when you kneel down. Pancake veggie. Yeah, but you're a ball, so that uh, doesn't even fit you. I'm not a I'm not a pancake. Okay, maybe you are. Yay! Because you're so pretty. Oh, you're pretty um, too. Yeah, um, I love having you, so you I are I love, I love having you. You're delightful to have around. And you're very fun. Yeah, fun bun. There's a whole lot you can actually do in the tank hanger. No. You can go in. You can go in here. There's oh, some yeah. goofy rooms. So calm suppressor. <laughs> goofy rooms. Goofy rooms. Yeah. Okay, so I just clipped the SOCOM suppressor. Which means my gun, it won't make any noise now when I shoot it. See? It doesn't make any noise. It made a noise. Well, it made a little pew sound. <laughs> but, you know, it doesn't make an actual gunshot noise, because if you fire your gun, the guards will hear it, and then you'll get, you know, alerted. I don't want that love. Okay. I want that. You wanna get you wanna get alerted? You want attention? Yeah. You want some attention from the veggie? Yeah. Okay. Cattleese. Uh oh, I spotted you, honey. Mom. Uh, Ow. Dum dum. <laughs> Probably should have had the mine detector on. <laughs> Ow. Veggie. Oh, See, yeah, you were crawling and they exploded anyway, so how did that work? Huh? No, I, no, I was... I'm, not, I'm walking. Oh yeah, also we got the camera. No, you were crawling, I saw that. No excuses. What? <laughs> Why... What are you doing? I'm just showing off the camera. <laughs> what about the camera? Yeah, it's just a fun little it's just a fun little item you can use. It doesn't do anything otherwise. Just you can just take pictures just for fun. Okay. Yeah, there's a lot of little items like that. Most of them don't do anything. Like uh, there's some other items I don't get to use usually, cutie. Like um there is the uh, the NVG. Puts this little night light filter on the screen. For what? <laughs> For what? Um, the only thing it does is it just helps you see in the dark better. Hmm. That's the only point of it. Um. And we also have, uh, and where you saw the cigarettes, there's also the scope, which lets you zoom in on things. Lets you get a better idea of your surroundings if you need that going on, yeah? I'm gonna yeah. zoom on you. Uh, here. 
You can zoom in on me. I am close to you, so why? <laughs> oh, hug me. Hug you. Hug you. That guy there? Mm. I, don't like, I don't like that guy no, is there right guy. now. Guy. Guy. walk past me. What is that guy doing? Uh, I don't want to get spotted by him, hon. <laughs> what is that guy doing? What is that guy doing? <laughs> what is that guy doing? Uh, he's trying to catch veggie. Okay, catch veggie then. <laughs> Stop right. going to the bathroom, <laughs> it's useless. Well, every now and then, love, even... every now and then, love, there's a health item in there. It's not even funny. <laughs> I'm not saying it's funny, Wifey. Why you always gotta assume everything's funny? Because you act like it. Aw, is when... Veggie is Veggie funny? Mm-hmm. Yay, that'll be. So oh, honey, yeah. so that's why Honey really cares if I'm funny or not. Why? <laughs> Because BB's always um, are like, Veggie, that's not funny. You gotta be funnier. <laughs> so what? Are you funnier? Um, I will keep being funny for you. Okay. Gotta watch out for the doggies. Why? What's wrong with them? Uh, if the doggies see you, they might charge at you, so you gotta be careful. This little doggy, he, he's, 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 he's okay, though. Mm, yeah, he's a little five card. Are you ready for a sniper battle, hon? Yeah. Anti-anxiety drug temporarily stops involuntary trembling. <laughs> what? You need that? Um, you don't need it, but it makes uh, aiming the, the rifle easier. Can't see. Oh, I saw him. Why is she so damn slow? How oh, is she up? Almost as slow as Veggie. Oh. But all it. I get into position. What? Fuck. <laughs> Veggie, you're so damn slow. Oh, so slow. <laughs> I would have beaten her on the first try. <laughs> because I'm a pro sniper. Aw, oh, yes, it's very true, Muffin. I know. Yeah, very good, Pumpkin. I know. Where are you even aiming at? I'm trying to, I'm trying to aim at her. Or not. Oh, it's so hard though. I'd be more worried about your life, but okay. 
I notice how notice the wobbling. Yeah. Yeah, that's what happens when you don't take the drug. Dude, veggie. Right. Shit. Did you left? I think she can see me from here. Yeah, that's why she changed spots. Is she freaking stupid? Why did <laughs> she? She is a she is a good thing. Come on. <laughs> She's I, not a I, good sniper. I would want snipe you easy. Oh. I got her. Oh. Just gonna get some more PSG ammo real quick. Snake, wouldn't now be a good time to save your mission? What's going on? I'm not sure. I'm getting a bad feeling. Bad feeling? Something you ate? No, I'm serious. Like a premonition or something. Snake, it's all up to you. Good job with Wolf. Is Meryl okay? I don't know. I don't see her around. You don't think she's been captured, do you? Could be. Let's ask Wolf. If she's still alive, I'm gonna get some answers. Snake. About Meryl. I'm counting on you. Alright, let's keep going, Bun Bun. Try and not be a big dum dum. Why? Hmm. <laughs> because uh, otherwise I'll get embarrassed by Bun Bun. Okay, you will. Wow. So is something up? Hmm. Yeah, something's about to happen. Yeah, there's those little rat friends up there. Gross. Yeah, I know Kitty doesn't like rats. No one likes that. Don't move! It's hard to miss when you're this close. Toss your weapon over here. Slowly. You are a fool to come back here. Stupid man. Okay. Sniper, huh? Didn't you know that two thirds of the world's greatest assassins are women? Do you want to die now? Or after your female friend? Which will it be? I'll die after I kill you. Is that right? Well, at least you've got spirit. I am Sniper Wolf. And I always kill what I aim at. Oh. You're my special prey. Got it. Oh, I've left my mark on you. I won't forget it. Until I kill you, you're all I think about. Take him away. Ice rain warning, hun. Yeah. Don't kill me yet. I'm too alive. Leave it to me. I want no more exits like that dark chief. Yes, he's my target. My mind.
He's tougher than I thought. Do you know who I am? I always knew that one day I would meet you. The man who stole what was rightly mine. The man who stole my birthright. Me? I'm the man you stole everything good from. And now? After the sacrifice of our brothers, after 30 long years, finally, the two of us meet. The brother of light and the brother of dark. Do you need his DNA too? Yes. I want a sample while he's still alive. We need it to correct the genome soldiers' mutations. Then we'll be able to cure them? No. We still have to get our hands on Big Boss's DNA. Have they given in to our demands yet? Not yet. They won't give in. They're all hypocrites, every one of them. Is that your opinion as a Kurd? They always put politics first. That's right. That's why they want to avoid any leak about their precious new nuclear weapon. Boss, it looks like our friend is awake. There definitely is a resemblance, don't you think, little brother? Or should I say, Big Brother? I'm not sure. Anyway, it doesn't matter. You and I are both the last surviving sons of Big Boss. It's me. Really? Then what? Oof, those idiots! All right, Raven. I'll be right there. They're not responding to our demands. We launched the first one in ten hours as planned. Damn Americans. Looks like you read them wrong. Something's funny. Normally the Americans are the first ones to the negotiating table. They must think they've got something up their sleeves. So it's come down to it, has it? We're going to launch that nuke and ride it all the way into history. I've got to take care of some launch preparations. You're in charge here, Ocelot. What about you? Wanna stay for the show? I'm not interested. It's time to feed the family. So you prefer your wolves to my show, huh? Ocelot, don't screw up like you did with the Chief. Yes, I know. That was an accident. I didn't think a pencil pusher like him would be so tough. Well, his mental defenses were reinforced by hypnotherapy. Boss, what about that ninja? He's killed 12 men. Whoever he is, he's some kind of lunatic. Bastard took my hand. How could he have gotten in here? Perhaps there's a spy among us. Mantis is dead. We've also got to find out what killed Baker and Octopus. We're short-handed, so make this little torture show of yours as short as possible. Torture? This is an interrogation. As you wish. See you later, brother. Your woman is still in this world. Meryl. Catch you later, handsome. Once she picks a target, she doesn't think about anything else. Sometimes she even falls in love with them before she kills them. Finally, just the two of us. How are you feeling? Not bad. Caught a nice nap on this revolving bed of yours. Too bad I was sleeping alone. Glad to hear that. This is some bed, all right. I'm about to show you some of its nicer features. Where are my things? Oh, don't worry. They're all there. Washington was taking quite a chance sending you here. Someone must have had a lot of faith in your skill, huh, carrier boy? So, Metal Gear is armed with a new type of nuclear warhead, huh? Why don't you go ask Campbell for the full story? 
the Colonel. By the way, you got an optical disc from President Baker, didn't you? What if I did? Is that the only disc? There's no other data? What do you mean? There's no copy? Do not. That's fine. Is Meryl okay? She's not dead yet. Wolf must have been feeling generous. But if you want her to stay that way, you better start answering my questions right now. Oh You're boy. holding one card key. Where are the other two? What's the trick behind that key? Trick? That weasel of a president said there's some kind of trick to using the key. Hell if I know. I see. No problem then. We're going to play a game, Snake. And we'll find out what kind of man you really are. When the pain becomes too great to bear, just give up and your suffering will end. But if you do, the girl's life is mine. Oh, let's see if I can Press do this. Press the circle button repeatedly to regain your strength. When you've had enough, Press the select button to submit. When your life reaches zero, hard? the game yeah. is over. Infamous there are hard. no continues, my friend. Oh, no, Don't even do think okay. about using auto file. Sweep time. Oh, no. mm -hmm. oh, sweep time. <laughs> I'm going to run a high sweep voltage time. electric current through your body. If it's just for a short time, it won't kill you. But I never heard that before. You're a tough guy, Snake. But I've got some bad news for you. You're no POW. You're a hostage. There's no Geneva Convention. No one is coming to save you. Starting to feel a little scared. Good. You should be. Okay. Let's get started. Alright, smashing time. Okay, here we go. Thank you, hon. I've never done this on the PS1 version. This looks cool. How did you like that? <laughs> Shall we go again? Really cool. <laughs> <laughs> Had enough yet? We're not finished yet. You know the electric tr uh, chair has three faces? It has what? The electric chair has three phases. Three phases? Yep. So the first one it's kicks you okay. out of consciousness, second on? one is uh, Can you take one kills you, and the third one is like a 100% kill rate. Ooh, that's rough. Yes. You're a strong man. Well, that's enough for now, I think. For now, I You're think. For now. Brother, right. No, I'm not safe. You from that? Man. Thank you. <laughs> Who else could shoot down to I'm gonna save me. I will. Yeah, the Les Enfants Terribles project yeah. was not a total failure. No. He is the no one electricity. man who made my dream no. reality. No electricity for Reggie. Okay. That was just the first part. There's still another one after. Reggie, come on. <laughs> he said for now, I think, so I bet. For now, yeah. <laughs> you can rest easy. Okay, wifey. Right, Hobby? Mm -hmm. You can? Huh? Huh? Looks like I got a roommate. Yeah, oh, that one. Darpa Jeep? Nice box. What a stench. Nice what? <laughs> nice box. Nice box. Because he had box. <laughs> Bugs, because he had oh, bugs in his oh, room. Yeah. Like some. Shut up in there, will ya? Shut up in there, will ya? Shut up! 
Why are you doing this? Oh, that's Shut funny. Up. You can annoy the guard. <laughs> not to give in to their demands. We're trying to buy some more time. Come on, Colonel. Why don't you stop playing dumb? I'm sorry about Merrill, but I want the lies to end now. What are you talking about? Metal Gear was designed to launch a new type of nuclear warhead, wasn't it? You knew it all along, didn't you? Why did you try to hide it? I'm sorry. Can't tell the grunts, huh? You've changed a lot. Metal Gear? Secret advanced nuclear weapons research? Does the White House know about this? How deep does it go? As far as I know, as of yesterday, the President had not been briefed about the Rex project. Need to know basis, is that the idea? These are sensitive times. Even subcritical nuclear tests are causing quite a stir. Plausible deniability, huh? Yes. And tomorrow, the President and his Russian counterpart are scheduled to sign the START III Accord. I get it. That's the reason for the deadline. <laughs> that's right, Snake. And that's why we can't let this terrorist yeah, attack go public. Mm. We yeah. still haven't even ratified Star Two or that's dealt that. with the issue of TMDs. Yeah. This has to do with that's the president's that. reputation and America's place as the dominant mm, okay. superpower. So patriotism is your excuse for circumventing the Constitution? Yeah. Please, Snake. Mm. Just stop them. Why should I? Because you're the only one who can. In that case, tell me the truth about this new type of nuclear warhead. I told you before, I don't know the details. I don't believe you. If the situation is so serious, why don't you give in to their demands? Let them have Big Boss's remains. You see? Or is there some reason that you can't do that? Something you haven't told me about? Publicly, the President has been very vocal in his opposition to eugenics experiments. We don't want the existence of the Genome Army to go public. And that's the only reason? Huh. Hell with you. I'm sorry. The corpse of the DARPA chief is lying right here next to me. Poor man. But it's strange. He looks and smells like he's been dead for days. All his blood's been drained out, too. Drained? Maybe to slow down decomposition? I have no idea. But the chief only died a few hours ago, right? Right. But he's already started to decompose. What could it all yeah. be about? Something in his blood that they wanted? I doubt it. Just the nanomachines in the transmitter. Did the chief tell them his detonation code? I'm afraid so. It looks like they've got both codes and are nearly ready to launch. Damn. Is there any way to prevent it? It seems that there's some type of emergency override device that can cancel out the detonation code. It's a countermeasure that Arms Tech installed secretly. You have to unlock it with three special card keys. And where are those keys? I've got one of them. I don't know where the other two are. Besides, I'm locked up here. We've got no choice. Forget about the keys. Your top priority now is to destroy Metal Gear itself. I'm sorry to have to lay it all in your lap, but you're all I've got. Bust out of there and get to the communications tower. Also... What? I know it's asking a lot. Meryl, right? Yeah. I'll save her. Thanks. What the Snake is too good. Hmm? Also, why? what is wrong with your status? Hmm. What did you say about Snake? He's too nice. He's too nice? <laughs> Nice. And, and as for my status, um, YouTube is getting through my ad blocker again. Very good. Why good? I support that. Good. Why do you support Veggie being in pain? You're not in pain, you're just whining. Or I am. Exactly. So why should I feel bad for you? Snake. Oh. It's showtime. Oh. Ocelot wants you. Um... Uh.
But this is broken because the uh, ET okay. comments I'll are not. Oh, true. Honey's com Honey's cute. Press the honey roast comments didn't work. To regain your strength. Yeah. When you've had enough. Which is very sad. I wanted to see them. To submit. Then give me more videos and I'll add some. The game is over. Oh, sure, there pumpkin. are no continues, my friend. Why don't you offer I them yourself, huh? Hmm, I can do it after. Eritrea, okay. Among the Mujahideen guerrillas, I was known and feared. The what? The Mujahideen? I was trained by the Russian rule. I am not like one of those KGB slugs. To me, this isn't torture. It's a sport. No one gives no, a shit what he finds, okay? Don't then go end up in an electric fools. chair, please. No, like your I'll be one, I will be one of the five doctors to verify if we are alive still. Okay, oh, I see you, Leon. Go. You know, I actually heard an audio really? of an electric chair person. His name was Mickey. It's an interesting story, BB. Very interesting story. And he learned so much. How did you like that? Yeah. Shall we go again? No. But like... I just discovered that they had to have six... No, five doctors to verify... Yeah, he's dead. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's dead. <laughs> Not stuff. enough yet? We're not finished yet. And I still can't figure out how painful the electric chair is. What do you think? What do you think? You still okay? I imagine... You the, I can imagine they feel like a tickle. And then the more? worst ones, it feels like your whole body is burning. <laughs> no. I literally oh. said the first space knocks your consciousness out. Literally. Oh. But the second phase is like, yeah, it's kind of You're like, it's literally boiling well, your blood. Now, I think. Ooh, yikes, that's painful. We live in a sad and the third phase just kills you. Imperialism, Damn. Totalitarianism, I mean, Eritrea. normally what is survive second, but some people survive second, so they would, they you ideology. know, die on the third. Right. Today has they gotta be really strong to survive second. Between freedom and order. And with that struggle, yeah, the spirit of nationalism really. Born. But again, if you lose consciousness, then in the Russian government. no. He's currently the head of Spetsnaz. He's agreed to purchase this new nuclear weapons system. The Hind was just a down payment. So you're in this for money. It kind of messed up how I want the, Russia to be reborn, it was to lead a brave new world. And there, I remember this one story I read about. It was this like kid, really kid, like 12 year old or some, and he got unfairly accused, That's and good. and he got the electric chair and he died, even though he was proved innocent. Like um, so he died for nothing. Damn, that sucks. You don't say. Mm -hmm. So. I'm hiding under the bed. Why can't I do that? <laughs> yeah, I'm hiding under the bed, huh? Yeah. Nothing new to report. Snake, is there anything I can do? Yeah. My arm hurts. Poor snake. I'll increase the level of painkillers in your blood. Okay, but you can leave out the benzodrine. That stuff makes me too frisky. <laughs> I guess you're not feeling too bad after all. Snake, put the controller up against your arm. What? Don't worry, it'll feel good. Huh? Okay, here I go. Uh. How does that feel, Snake? A little better? How did you do that? I stimulated your muscle fibers with the nanomachine cilia. That's about all I can do for you. Naomi, please talk to me. Say something to take my mind off the pain. What can I say? Anything. I... I'm not a very good talker. That's me. Real. <laughs> <Please. laughs> <Talk laughs> yourself. Myself. That's a tough one. 
Any family? <sighs> That's not a happy topic for me. I don't have any family. No. Wait. There was a man who said he was my father. Where is he? Dead. By my own hand. <laughs> Big Boss. What? Big Boss? I had no idea. There was no way you could. It happened in Zanzibar six years ago. Only Snake and I know the real truth of what happened there. So... Is it true? Was Big Boss really your father? That's what he said. That's all I know. And you were able to kill him? Knowing that? Yep. <laughs> wow. Who yep. yep. Besides, some people just need killing. That's patricide. Yep. Yep. That's the yeah. drama that Mantis <laughs> was talking about. The one we share in common. Is that why you left Foxhound? Let's just say that I needed to be alone for a while, and Alaska was the perfect place. <sighs> Snake. I didn't have a real family either. Just a big brother who put me through school. We weren't even blood related, and he was much older than me. Where is he? He's dead. I'm sorry. Snake, is there a woman in your life? After you've been through as many wars as me, it's hard to trust anyone. Hmm. Friends? Roy Campbell. <laughs> You're still calling me friend? Is that it? No. There was another. Frank Yeager. What? Big Boss's most trusted lieutenant. And the only member of Foxhound ever to receive the code name Fox. Gray Fox. I learned a lot from him. But d didn't you try to kill each other? That's true. We did, in Zanzibar. But it was nothing personal. We were just professional. Nothing on personal, sides, my own. Nothing personal. And you still call yourself friends? Hard to believe. War is no reason to end a friendship. That's insane. I hey, Reggie. Oh, hey, hon. Gonna end up he in a war? Going oh, yeah. against but each other? Like and still love each other? He was always so yeah. Cool and precise. Yeah, good idea. I was still green. What are we he gonna do? No. <laughs> you knew him well. I have no idea. No. Oh, no we never on. talked about our personal lives. <laughs> sort of an Get into a fight and still love anyway. The next time I saw yeah, him and the then do what? We and then cuddle. We were fighting barehanded in a minefield. We can't cuddle. They're battle. Battle in the middle of a war. But we were just two soldiers doing our yeah. jobs. It's like a sport. <laughs> no, you know what you should do? You're like wild animals. You just run away. You're right. All right, tiny, run away. Yeah. So if you were friends, then how do you explain the ninja's behavior? I don't know. <sighs> it's your genes. Then it was right. A romantic story, like really a novel. Like talking about genes, Naomi. Oh. <laughs> Why did you get into genetics? Romantic couple January? leaves in the middle of the war. I never knew who my parents no, were. No, too long. Why did they leave? Like. I guess I got into genetics because I wanted to figure out why I am the way I am. So you studied about DNA? Uh-huh. Yeah. Okay. What's the name? What would the name be? Really um... I thought that by analyzing a person's a veggie and the bun. information, I could retrieve <laughs> the blank oh, spots in that person's so memory. Oh. Memory is stored in DNA. No, I love us, We're not but, sure, but we know that a person's genetic fate right? is determined a war about by us. the sequence of the four bases in their DNA. So what about my fate? You know my um, DNA sequence, don't you? Your fate? I, I'm sorry, I have war, no idea. War against Of course Sonic. not. You're a scientist, Ooh, okay. not a fortune teller. Yeah, you too. Mm-hmm. Mm. What? Oh, yeah. What? <laughs> what? He had to go to the bathroom. <laughs> Me too. Me too. Not my thing. Was the bathroom? Oh, you, you can go to the bathroom. No, you can't. Okay, thank you, love. So tell me when hey, I'm here. Where?
I forgot me, about him. Otacon. Yeah, he's back. Oh, well. even capture you. Hurry, get me out of here. It, let me go. That hurts. Hurry up. Is that how you ask a guy a favor? Let me go. Jeez, it's like an animal's cage. Oh, what a smell. Because of him. Yeah, it's the Derpa chief. You don't hurry up and get me out of here. I'll be laying next to him. Those bastards. This lock won't open with a security card. You need a key like the soldiers carry. So what are you doing here then? I... I thought you might be hungry. If you need more food, I can bring some more later. Also, I got you this level six card. It'll get you out of that torture room. Here, take this too. What's this? It's a handkerchief. I got it from Sniper Wolf. Why? I don't know why, but she's nice to me. Sounds like Stockholm Syndrome to me. <laughs> uh -huh. Do you even know what Stockholm Syndrome is? Yeah, it has something to do with like when you're being abused and you think they're being nice to you or something like that. Oh, she likes dogs. She must be a good person. Please don't hurt her. Wake up, you idiot. She's the one who shot Meryl. Well, that's all I can do. They're planning to launch a nuke. I've got to stop them. Then you have to get past the communications tower. First, you have to get me out of here. Come on, I'm trying my best. That guard's got the key. You'll have to take him out. Give me a break. I'm no soldier. I can't take anybody out. You have to. I'll be killed. Oh, well, just by standing there, he will already be killed. Oh, yeah. Oh, jeez. He's coming back. See you later. Wait. Hmm, we got ketchup. Well, he's holding a bowl of ketchup. Isn't that noticeable? Nah, definitely not noticeable. What the hell? What the hell? That's what, my reaction. What the hell? Why is he holding a ketchup bottle? Yeah, let's get out of here. Why did he give us ketchup for? And says he, oh, you're hungry? Okay, have some ketchup. <laughs> so, you figured out what I had in mind, huh? I can't believe it actually worked. Oh, so he found it, okay. <laughs> yep. Oh, I was gonna say, what, what, what do you think? Snake, wait a minute. You forgot to take your items. They're probably being kept somewhere close by. Oh. <laughs> about your equipment you are not going to leave behind everything you've collected are you hurry grab your stuff that's funny they all comment on that <laughs> i was too <laughs> you're like veggie you forgot your stuff yeah oh there's a bathroom here veggie what's what? your obsession with bathrooms <laughs> I always go to the bathroom, but come on, I don't think I need to check every single bathroom in every room, <laughs> even the torture room. Hmm, yeah. Hmm, let me check my inventory real quick. Huh, what's this doing in here? What's that? I got a bomb in my inventory. That? That was a close one, Snake. Ocelot, you'll pay for that. Yeah, he planted a bomb on his equipment. <laughs> hmm. Hey, Master. That was too close, Snake. Yeah, that was quite a surprise, all right. Hiding a bomb in your items. That's a despicable act. He should never... Well, forget it. You'd better hurry to the underground base. You're almost out of time. Uh, what time? 
Got 10 hours left before they launch the nuke. Alright, let's head back to... What? What's Whoa. going on with the camera? It was floating. Oh, um... That's not that. That's because I used the chaff grenade. Veggie, I know. I'm not stupid, Muffin. but I'm saying it was floating. Oh, <laughs> I'm not sure. Maybe some PS1 limitations or something. No, it's your fault. Oh, Veggie's fault now? Okay, what no, can, what can, what can Veggie do to fix it? Thing. Mm hmm? Mm hmm? Thing. Okay, mama. Mama, like that. I love kissing button, that fixes everything. It gives me more. Okay, mama. One more. Reggie, careful. Okay, I'll be careful this time. It's floating. Hmm. Well, I mean, it's supposed to be hanging on that little stick thing, but I guess it kind of looks like it's floating. Yeah, I'll see how I'm going. More grenades. Um, I don't need any rations. I'm good on those. Sweep? Yeah. Mm. Yeah, yeah. You're getting sweepy? Yeah, yeah. Mm. Let me know when I should stop. Okay. Just a box. Yeah. Alright, back down we go. You remember, Kitty, when I talked about how we'd be coming back to this floor? Uh-huh. I do. Yeah? Yeah. Yep, there's a reason for that. It's a level 3 door. Thermal goggles. Get some C4. Get some Nikitas. And most importantly, um, there's supposed to be another thing here. They're supposed to be bo they're supposed to be body armor, but I don't think it's here. I think you might get a little bit later actually. Well the thermal goggles is not bad. Thank you. 
Here's some stun grenades. Can it hurt? Alright. I'm just, I'm just getting confused, love. Because, um... In the, uh, the GameCube version, you come down here to get the, uh, the body armor. But it's actually the thermal goggles in this version. I'm pretty sure you get the body armor a bit later in the PS1 version. So, yeah. Yeah, yeah, there is a guard. Pretty sure one of these is like a level 5 door. There's medicine. There's also some diazepam. Some more bullets. You know, the usual stuff behind you. We're actually gonna make some progress now, love. You having a good nap? Mm -hmm. Oh, very good. I'll wake you up when something interesting happens. Because we're kind of at the, the backtracking part of the game. Well, there's actually two instances of backtracking. This is the first bit. Get to say hi to the doggies one last time. Oh, here we go, hon. strain warning as well. <laughs> free will. I'm sure she was prepared for this. No. You're wrong. Meryl thought she had to become a soldier. Thought it was the only way. She said she thought it would bring her closer to her dead father. She said that? She wasn't ready for real combat. I shouldn't have pushed her so hard. It's all my fault. It's not like you, Snake. Master, what is it? Sorry for eavesdropping. But I just couldn't listen anymore. Master. Snake, you can have regrets if you want to. It's only natural. But you can't keep attacking yourself for things that happened in the past. That road leads to madness. Believe me. He's right. Don't kick yourself. It doesn't suit a legend like you. I'm sure Meryl's just fine. Mei Ling. Snake, forget about Meryl. Stop Liquid. That's what Meryl would want too. You're right. Meryl would say the same thing. Snake. What? Meryl. She's pretty special to you, huh? Yes, she's special. There aren't many women like her around. That's not what I meant. She's the Colonel's niece and a combat buddy. Is that all? 
Come on. This is like a police interrogation. No, I just... I guess it's in the genes. The genes? What are you talking about, Colonel? <laughs> no. I just remembered about Naomi's grandfather. I think Naomi said he rose as high as assistant secretary in the FBI during Edgar Hoover's time. Is that right? Yes. Yes, uh, he was uh, Japanese, and he became a special undercover investigator to nab the mafia. Oh, like you, honey. When was that? Oh, uh, sometime in the 50s, I guess. Where? Uh, New York, I think. Naomi, I thought you didn't have any family. Well, I, I researched it after I became an adult. My grandfather was already dead by the time I learned about him. I never even had the chance to meet him. Oh. Snake, good luck. Watch your back, Snake. Yes, the magic. Yes, you won bullets. I think this might be a good time to end. What do you think, hon? Hey. You caught Snake? I think we can probably call it here for today. Mm -hmm. In China, they say. Rashness brings success to few, misfortune to many. Snake, go forward when it's safe, but retreat when there's danger. You'll just have to play it by ear depending on the circumstances. Okay. That's where we'll end it for today, then. So, thank you everybody for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe to me on YouTube and Twitch. Twitchy. Uh, to veggie. Also make sure to check out uh, Santa Buntan at Kafo mm. on Instagram. Mm. And we will see everybody in the next episode of Metal Gear Solid. So, see everybody then. Mm. Thank you.